Well, Kevin Gates was asked about the whole Boosie beef on TMZ, and he said, I don't have any beef with Boosie anymore. It's over. Um, Boosie has said this uh, a couple months ago, but uh, it's good to see Kevin Gates and them moving forward because they had quite a beat before. Let's get into this. Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that bell, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up button. Okay, so back about two and a half years ago, Kevin Gates and Boosie got into it. Uh, they were booked at a Kentucky Derby together at an after party, and Boosie actually, like, I guess made Kevin Gates or took his DJ off stage and they got into a brawl. Um, and then Kevin Gates taunted him afterwards saying, Hey, one of you guys lost your phone, blah, blah, blah. It went on, you know, since then Kevin Gates had gone to jail and came home and, uh, you know, Boosie ended the beef first, I think, or announced the end of the beef. But this all stems from one of, um, one of Kevin Gates guys getting killed, Chris Nusi Jackson, he was killed. Uh, and actually, Boosie was acquitted of that murder, uh, but he was guilty at first and he was implicated. But it turns out some other guy did it uh, named Louding. Um, he was convicted because he was there was footage of him at a gas station just right after it happened. Um, so Gates associate uh Nusi was it wasn't tied to Boosie anymore but you know I think for a while Gates thought it was him and you know he blamed and they had a they had a problem with it and there were some subliminals on records going back and forth at each other well Boosie a few months ago I don't know if any of you guys missed it but he went on live and he was trying to get um Kevin Gates to come to his show he said you just got off the line with Kevin Gates Trying to pull it off so he can perform at Boosie Bash. The city needs this. Boosie Bash 2018. Say a prayer tonight that he's allowed to travel ASAP. Biggest show in Louisiana has ever seen. Go get your tickets. BoosieBash.com. Um, now, Boosie. I, I'd love to hear Boosie and Kevin Gates again. Now, Kevin Gates was recently on TMZ. He said, uh, we don't have any beef. Never had yeah, they're just saying it never happened. But it, it happened for a while. But it's good to see these guys moving forward because they're both great artists. You know, and they, they both have their fans and everything. I, I like Kevin Gates' music. I love Boosie's music. It's glad to see that they ended this problem. Um, anyways, guys, what do you guys think about this? This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that bell, hit the subscribe button. I'm trying to dig up some news for you guys. There's not a lot going on out here. But as soon as it breaks, I'll keep you in the loop. Make sure you hit that bell, hit that subscribe button. When you hit the bell, make sure you subscribe to all videos to be notified for all videos. Because when I drop a video, you want to be in the loop. All right, guys? I appreciate you guys. Peace.